It's just after 9 a.m. at the WWP1 Geofumal Production Site in Luda. A flurry of activity on this wet Tuesday morning as officials prepared for the initiation of a flu test. This will determine the generation capacity of this production well. It's a sensitive operation and nothing is left to chance. Security is priority and the presence of officials of the Dominica Red Cross, Fire and Ambulance Service and the Commonwealth of Dominica Police Force is a sign that officials are prepared for any uncertainties. We ensure that all persons within the exclusion zone was off-site or evacuated before. We then had the assistance of our fire officers to open up the valve for the very first time. Then we, did, we checked the air quality on the site and around the site to ensure that all of the gas was released and dispersed. And then, as you can see, we have steam and hot fluid coming up to the surface, and then all personnel was allowed back on site. It would take this fire officer to get this flu test started, a test which will run for the next six days. We initiated the test at 9.27 this morning, and by 9.35, the gas cap was released, and the immediate danger was um, as it had passed, and now we just have steam and hot fluid coming up to the surface. This morning's exercise was another step in the ongoing efforts by the DLP administration to ensure that it adopts the best practices as it forges ahead in its quest to harness the existing geothermal energy potential. Energy Minister Honorable Reuben Blackmore, who witnessed the test, told GIS News that the administration is committed to the safety of residents of the Roseau Valley as it continues its geothermal energy pursuits. We have to continue to, to ensure that we put all systems in place to ensure that um, the safety of the people of Lodan and Dominican whole is, is not compromised at all. The objective of this project by government is to ensure the provision of cheaper and more reliable source of energy. We have to get to the point in our development as a people where we can create an environment where we can actually entice energy intensive companies to come here and to set a shop and to create 21st century jobs for our children and our children's children. And of course, the issue of high energy costs is a drag to any economy. And we believe that our effort in geothermal is going to pay off and pay off in, in, in a big way. There has been concerns raised by residents and government has responded by hosting meetings in the Roseau Valley with engineers from around the world with decades of experience in geothermal energy production. With the increasing cost of energy worldwide, there is a growing focus on renewable sources of energy. In Dominica, the DLP administration is focused on the exploration of its geothermal potential. Geothermal energy is something that we possess in Dominica. We have it in abundance, we have an abundance of it, and we have to you know, harvest it for people and the future of our country. For National Focus, I am Moving Mafia reporting.